I'm so excited that you're here. I have an amazing story to share with you today. But first, let me ask you a question. Do you ever walk into a room looking for something and then once you get there, you forget what you're looking for? Or maybe it's that time you go to the fridge looking for your favorite snack and you just can't find it. You look once, you look twice, and you look a third time and it was finally there right in front of you the whole time. I can't tell you how many times that happens to me, but that's the perfect story for today. Because I'm going to tell you a story today of the disciples that just couldn't see what was right under their noses. Because you see, this was right after Jesus was resurrected, right after Easter. And Jesus had already appeared to Mary, and now he's about to appear to some of his disciples. You see, the disciples were out walking down the road to Emmaus, and they were talking, and then Jesus appeared to them. And Jesus said, hey guys, what are you talking about? But the Bible here says that the disciples didn't even recognize who Jesus was. Jesus was probably wearing a disguise. It probably went a little something more like this. Hey guys, what are you talking about? And the disciples traveled with Jesus all day long down the road until nightfall where they reached the village where they were going. And then it says here that the disciples had invited Jesus to stay with them for the night as nightfall was soon approaching. And as they were all getting settled down for the night, they began to have dinner together and Jesus did this. Jesus took some bread he blessed it and broke it and passed it out to all the disciples, just like he did at the Last Supper. And then the disciples finally recognized who he truly was. Oh, gotta go. And that's the end of our story. Do you guys ever miss something that's right in front of you? I mean, like right under your nose, like you definitely should have noticed. Well, the truth of the matter is a lot of us miss what's right in front of us. It's hard to pay attention all the time, but just like in our story, I think we come across Jesus way more than we ever thought. We just tend to miss it sometimes. Sometimes we might miss that thing that's right in front of us in the fridge, or sometimes we might miss when someone we love is pretending to be happy when they're really sad. So that's why I want you to be on the lookout this week. Let's try and do a little better than our disciples did today and be on the lookout for where Jesus might be in our lives. You never know where he might show up. Or maybe it's that feeling that you have inside your gut that's urging you to go say sorry. And to help us do this, let's say a quick prayer asking God to help us be more vigilant. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you so much for the story that we get to hear today. That we get to hear a story about Jesus' closest friends not even recognizing who he was right in front of him. But Lord, we ask that we can be more vigilant. We ask that we notice who you are and where you've been in our lives, in our daily lives. Help us to not ignore you or, or to miss opportunities of when you show up, Lord. Uh, help us to keep our eyes open and to see where you're at in our lives, where you're guiding us, where you're moving us, uh, and what, what people you're putting in front of us, Lord. Uh, help us to make the right decisions every step of the way and to see you. Lord, we love you very much and you rock our socks. Amen. As usual, thank you so much for being here. I hope you have a great week. How many changes did you notice in this video? Go back and see how many you missed. Until next week, God bless. <sighs> Rupert floats are so good. Oh yeah, so good.